express myself freely and be passionate in what I do. What's your favourite lesson and why? My favourite lesson is history and this is because I get to explore interesting events throughout history and debate different topics. introduce yourself? Hi, well welcome uh, to St Mary's Cambridge, all the girls at Mandeville Hall. Uh, we're delighted to be doing this little exchange film with you. My name is Charlotte Avery and I'm the headmistress, proudly of a loving another Mary Ward school uh, here in Cambridge and I've been the head for 14 years. How do you think St Mary's will help you grow as a better person here? I think St Mary's will make me more independent. These are, new, are our new long road sports facilities where we come and play a variety of different sports including tennis, netball, hockey and football. different to other schools. Okay well what makes us unusual certainly in the UK and in Cambridgeshire is that we are an all-girls school. Uh, we're the only single-sex school for boys or girls uh, in Cambridgeshire whereas I know that um, in Australia many more of the schools are indeed single-sex but we like that. So we're proud feminists um, at uh, our school St Mary's. I think what also makes us different is our very broad international intake. So we have lots of um, international boarders who stay with us uh, all their time as their second home, but we also have quite a lot of international girls in our day community. Because we're based in Cambridge, lots of families come over for work, so they work in the big um, teaching hospital at Brooks, or they work in the science parks, or with um, Microsoft or Apple or other big uh, spin-out technology companies. And then of course there are families who simply live and work here, but they have um, one or two parents who are not English, so we are very, very international. And I think a third area that makes us slightly different from other schools, certainly in Cambridge, is that we have a very broad ability intake and we're really, really proud of that. So we have lots of girls of different interests and different abilities and we hope that we can love and nurture each one of them. This is Honour and B. What is your favourite thing about St Mary's? Um, I like how everyone here is really positive and fun to know. I like how the teachers really put loads of effort into the lessons. This is our school chapel. We have special assemblies and services in here. This is the drama studio where we have our drama lessons. Great. And what has the COVID-19 pandemic taught you about our community? Um, it's taught us all to value our community. I didn't much enjoy trying to run the school from my study at home. I missed very much the lively interaction of the girls and seeing them outside and laughing and hearing them giggling in the corridors. I miss my staff 
colleagues as well. And I think the girls missed each other and missed their teachers. And I know that the teachers missed the girls and they missed their, uh, their teaching colleagues. So I think what we have most learned out of um, the COVID-19 pandemic is how to value ourselves as a living, breathing community. What it also taught me, made me very, very proud of that, was the girls, their resilience and their adapting. It was really hard to suddenly change onto online learning. Yes, of course, we have a digital strategy and the girls all have their Chromebooks, but it's very different suddenly having to learn online. And I was really, really proud of the way that the girls adapted and the staff adapted and everybody showed resilience. These are our central gardens, where students eat lunch and relax under our blooming magnolia tree. What is your favourite thing about St Mary's? The teachers. This is one of the science labs where we have biology. Good. This is our St Mary's boathouse, where our squads train every week. Um, it's located on the river Cam that runs through Cambridge. This is the gym where we have most of our PE lessons. Wonderful. My last question for you is what is your favourite Mary Ward characteristic and why? So um, in our school, we have what we call our 12 characteristics. This is a little bit different because I know that the Loretto schools have five and then some of them add in international dimension as number six and some others all add in as well. Um, women as a seventh one, but we, we have 12. I, mean, I love all of them. The girls slightly tease me because I always talk with great animation about all 12. But the one I'm gonna pick on now is seeing good in all creation because this for me is all about sustainability it's all about the environment and it's all about ecology and this is an area that we're really really beginning to look at in a lot more detail and some of you might know that um, Pope Francis wrote what he called a papal encyclical a laudate si a papal letter all about the environment five years ago and nobody has really listened hard enough to the Pope they're beginning now to listen to Greta Thunberg, a personal heroine of mine. But we've had people like Sir David Attenborough, who's been talking about ecology and the environment for decades. And although we like watching his programmes like Blue Planet, have we done enough? I don't think we have done enough. And this year, Britain is um, hosting the World Summit on Climate Change. And I really, really hope that everybody starts listening to the Pope starts listening to Greta more and starts listening to David Attenborough. So for me at the moment, the Mary Ward characteristic that I'm really thinking about is seeing good in all the creation. Thank you. Happy year seven interviews. We, we hope, hope you enjoyed, enjoyed this video. video.